Hi guys, welcome back to this channel and if it's your first time to come across of this channel, please consider subscribing. Support this channel by subscribing. By the way, do not forget to hit that bell notification. It's very important because you'll always be updated when I upload a new video. For the returning subscribers, thank you so much for coming back to this channel. For the new subscribers, by the way, don't forget to hit that notification bell. It's very important. It will give me more power and more energy to make more content for you. Remember, it's Max from the Max Creation TV. In today's video, we are yet still looking at another Middle East country. Remember, we are exploring opportunities across the Gulf, across the Middle East, and we are looking at what are the labor laws concerned, what are the opportunities available in these countries. In today's video, we are looking at another country, and that is Kuwait. What are we talking about? What are we looking about today? We are talking about gratitude. Gratitude or end of service bonus to many of you, as you may call it. End of service bonus or gratitude. Remember, end of service bonus is calculated differently in all the Middle East countries depending on how long you've worked with that employer or depending on how many number of number of years of service with that employer remember each of these middle east or gulf countries we are talking about or those that we've already talked about or those that we've already looked at most of these countries have what we call different they have what we call different labor laws and they have different articles that govern or spare that superlates their labor law, their working or employees or expatriates coming into their country at the same time. So when we look at gratitude itself, we are looking at that token of money or that token of appreciation that is given to the worker after completing a given service or a given number of years or after you complete your service with your employer. It is normally a token that it may be decided by your employer between you and the employer but remember as the government it gives or it gives a mandate and there's an article that is stipulated whereby each employer after completing a given service a given number of years of service with his employer is supposed to be given a given amount or is supposed to give a token of appreciation and that is what is called end of service bonus so when you complete a number of given years as you are trying to say or trying to resign try not to renew your contract with your employer remember there's some amount of money that is supposed to be given you but remember another clause is that it's not mandatory they're supposed to give you money in case there the, the, in case there is um disagreement in one way or the other because remember each of these labor laws in the gulf or in the labor laws in the middle east they are articles that try to protect the employer or the sponsor that he can try to terminate you without compensation without even giving you your gratitude so let us see how is gratitude calculated in kuwait remember we are now looking at kuwait one of the gulf or the middle east country like which is one of also the favorite destinations for all different nationalities that are looking for um, are looking for uh, bread on the plate remember as per article 62 of the Kuwait labor law the calculation of end of service bonus or gratitude is based on the last amount of money or the last remuneration that you received by a worker so the last amount they will calculate your end of gratitude depending on the last amount of money or the last salary that was paid to you let's say for example you've been working in the company and you've been getting 1200 1400 and your last salary as you're completing the contract is 1500 your end of service gratitude or end of service bonus calculation will be calculated 
looking at your last amount of salary that was paid for, to you and that is what we call the 1500 we are looking at and how is it paid and how is it paid this is paid remember in this event a where a worker is paid on a daily basis there are different categories and what are we talking about if for example in your company you have been employed and you have been employed and you are working on what we call a monthly basis it means that your gratitude for the first five years will be calculated you will be receiving 15 days per year if in your company you, you are working or you've been working in your company for the last five years your end of service bonus is going to be calculated as per 15 days of 15 days each year of your five years so meaning that your company will be paying you 15 days each year times the five years depending on how much you're getting i think i'm more i'm more we are on the same plan and if you for example you say i'm going to extend my contract i'm going to renew my contract with this company for the more five years or for the more three years that means your gratitude will be calculated according to every one month of each year will be part of your gratitude for that year i think we are right so wow how what does the statement say and how is it like 15 days of wages of each year of the first five years of service and one month wage for each year of service thereafter that is how gratitude is going to be calculated in Kuwait. if you're working for that employer on what you call a full basis and you are paid on a monthly basis for the first five years he will pay you 15 days each year as your gratitude then if you you renew your contract for the more years that means 30 days will be calculated as your gratitude each year after the five years then let us look at a situation whereby a worker is working on what you call a work is working on what you call a daily um, weekly or on a hourly or on a piece work basis if you are not paid on a monthly what does gratitude how do they calculate your gratitude in kuwait for that scenario if your work you are only paid hourly you are paid per piece of work you do or you are paid per daily after accomplishing a given task that means your gratitude will be calculated as 10 days of each year so in every year for the first five years you have 10 days of real gratitude as your end of service bonus then after five years completing after you complete five years and you wish to renew your contract with your employer for more years then that means that uh, your end of service bonus or your end of service bonus will be calculated as 15 days of each year as your end of service bonus for those people that are working under what you call a daily weekly or hourly those are paid in that category and what does it mean who is entitled to gratitude in kuwait someone may ask who is entitled to that gratitude in kuwait we all say that employers who are not beneficiary of the social insurance law in kuwait are entitled to what we call gratitude if you are not a beneficiary of what you call the social insurance law then you are you are a beneficiary or you are entitled to what you call gratitude payment by the end of your service that you worked with that employer at the time remember someone may also ask when does an employer becomes eligible to end of service bonus when are you supposed to receive your end of service bonus that may be a question 
to one of the viewers, yes, he has a right to know. When are you entitled to service bonus? Most of you ask that question and most of you do not have thought about that. Your end of service bonus will only be paid to you after completing your service with that employer. Let's say for example you sign a contract with the employer for five years and you are not waiting to renew your contract with that person. Then at the end of termination of that contract, you will have to be paid your end of service bonus. Because you're not going to work with that employer anymore. Your contract is done. Then also, you are entitled to end of service bonus in case of death. Let's say in case you die. But this time, it is your beneficiary or your next of kin that are going to benefit from your gratitude. Let's say your baby, your biological baby, or your, your spouse is the one that is going to benefit from what we call the end of service bonus. Then also another situation may be if you get, if you, in case of what you call disability, if you get any injury that deters you from continuing with that kind of role that you're doing now, the company will then be or will be forced to give you your end of service bonus. Thank you so much for coming back to this channel. Thank you so much for watching videos to this channel. And thank you so much for subscribing. By the way, guys, we are looking at the road to 2,000 subscribers. It is only your support. It is only by supporting Max Creation that we can be able to reach the road of 2,000 subscribers. Thank you so much for watching videos to this channel. See you again in the next video as we try to see more of the interesting articles and more of the interesting labor law articles in Kuwait. See you again in another video.